everything good. I'm happy. <laughs> You've got a fucking bow tie now. It's not supposed to be a bow tie. Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. Today I'm here with Poppy because she's a September favourite. Can we just appreciate this collar I just bought her? She's little jingle bells. Oh yeah. The red really brings out her green eyes. Look at the camera. <gasps> oh. I'll let you go now. Can you not jingle everywhere, please? Let's take that off for a bit. She's a September favourite. I did an August favourites. It was my first favourites video that I'd ever done. And I really liked doing it. And I think people liked it too. So I thought... I'd do one again because I've got some new favourite things this month. We're going to keep this nice and short and sweet. So, the first thing I'm going to talk about is... What should I talk about first? I've got quite a few things to show you guys. And I love them. A lot. If you watch my vlogs, you will have seen some of these things. But if you don't, then you're in for a treat. Start with these little... So I use these as slippers. They're not technically slippers, they're technically slider shoes because they have like a hard back but I just use them as slippers because I think they're cute and comfy but the only thing is soon my toes will get too cold because it's nearly winter so soon they might be too cold but I just love them, I think they're really cute, they're from Primark and they were really cheap, I think they were like I don't know, like eight pounds maybe? And um, yeah, I just think they look like, you look fashionable in your pajamas with them on. Cause it's like pajamas then, oh, she's got fashionable feet. That's them. There's not that much to say about them, but that's them. Next, we have a little product. So I went into Lush the other day and quite a lot of people have told me about these before, but I've never jumped the gun and just bought one. I've always just tried them in the shop and I'm like, oh yeah, they're so cool, but never actually bought one. But I bought a lip scrub, so it's the, can you, yeah, the chocolate lip scrub. And it's got like an orange chocolate tint, so it tastes a bit like Terry's chocolate orange. And basically, you can eat it after you put it on, which is a great thing. And it's all natural ingredients. I think it's like caster sugar. <laughs> I get quite dry lips. That's why I don't wear a lot of different lipsticks and stuff. Because they just dry out so quickly on my lips. And I have to always wear lip balm. That's why I mainly wear my tinted lip balm on my lips. But this just scrubs off the dead skin. So it's just like exfoliating your lips. And then you can lick it off after. So you know, great. A great invention by Lush that won't focus, but it's alright because you guys know what it is now. But yeah, I just thought it was cool. It's a cool little thing and it tastes nice. So, you know, it's a good one. So next we have this, which if you watch my vlog you'll know. This is my puppy, which is coming home in a week from today so when this is up it'll be like a few days which is so exciting i just found out this morning that it was going to be sooner than i thought because she was eating she's eating well so uh yes not just the basket it's a microwavable basket so it has this little pouch in the middle it's from pets at home it's got this little pouch and you can take the pouch out and put it in the microwave and then it warms up the bed and I think it's the cutest invention. Maybe they're really common, maybe I just don't know, but I accidentally bought it. So I bought it because I just thought it was a nice looking snuggly basket. And then <laughs> if you watch the vlog, I was literally in shock at the fact that you could warm up the basket. I originally thought you had to put the whole basket in the microwave and I was like, I don't think my microwave is big enough for this, but... Then I realised that you just take the pouch out and you have a warm bed for your baby dog. I think it's such a good invention. Like whoever invented this is a great person. Microwave bed. <laughs> I'll try and link all of this below as well because it should all still be there except the Primark slippers. I can't link because Primark doesn't have much online. I don't know why, but they just don't. So... Next, I'm going to talk about 
a very cool little necklace. So, can you see what it says? It says peachy on it. You guys know how I feel about peaches and bums and growing a big bum and being happy. And then I found a necklace that said it. Basically someone actually DM'd me on Instagram and told me about it and I was like, it's new to skinny dip. So this is also where my phone case is from, which is kind of a favorite as well actually. I bought a new peach case because everyone has the other one. And my old peach case with the peaches all over it when I was on holiday this summer, the peaches burnt off, like three peaches had burnt off. So I thought I needed a new one. And then I went to go and get the same one and then this new one had come out because they obviously know that peaches is the thing at the moment. I think it's cool. But that was from Skinny Dip as well as this. So this is new to Skinny Dip. And this is peachy, which I just think is a very good invention of necklaces. All of these things in my favourites video are just good inventions. Like whoever invented them is a great person. But yeah, that's from Skinny Dip. I think that was about £12. Could be wrong. I only bought it about two weeks ago, but I'm not sure. Next, I'm going to show you some camo leggings. So I'll pop up a little picture where I wore them in recently on my um, Instagram. And I had lots of questions. They're from Pretty Little Thing, and they're just so flattering. Pretty Little Thing's new leggings, well, maybe they're not new, but the leggings I bought from Pretty Little Thing recently have been so nicely fitted. Like, they're roomy, but they, they're they really high-waisted, and but then have lots of room in the bum, so it doesn't squish your bum, which I find the majority of leggings do, but not Pretty Little Thing. And I just like camo... <laughs> I just like camo at the moment. I also got a little top, a camo top, which obviously I wouldn't wear all together because then I'd kind of look a little bit strange. But I think if you have one piece of camo clothing, you could make it look really cool. If you have more than one, you might look a little bit wrong. I don't know actually. Probably someone's done it and look good. They go with like every plain top and they just spice up outfits, which I love. I like the little spicy bits of items that you can wear that spice up outfits. And this is one of them. And they just fit so well. I wear a size, what size do I wear actually? Mine are a size six. That's what I wear in Pretty Little Thing. Because as I've said in my PLT hauls, Pretty Little Thing kind of runs a little bit bigger so I go down a size in leggings not in jeans but in leggings it pretty little thing I go down a size because they're really stretchy that's the key thing with good leggings I think yes can we just appreciate Poppy's little collar that I bought her autumnal collar and then there'll be the Christmas collar when we get to November not allowed to do the Christmas collar yet Niall said so I got this and I'm going to get Bluebell a matching one, I think, if I can. But a harness style, I think. Can you not play with the peachy necklace? No. It's kind of Christmassy though, isn't it? It is a little bit Christmassy. I subtly stuck in the Christmasness to it. But I'm going to wear tartan soon and match them. Just thought it was cute. I saw it in the pet shop today. Um, I have three more things to show you guys. No, I haven't. I've got four. Got four more things. So if you watched one of my latest vlogs, I talked about this. This dressing gown is the best dressing gown in the world. If you know me, I wear dressing gowns whenever I'm at home really, because they're just the best things in the world. It was 15 pounds from Primark. I got a new one because my pink one was for a 12 year old and it was about time that I invested in something new which I because obviously I wear it every day as well and I was like this is kind of disgusting so I got this one um, and it's just a lot more grown up <laughs> it's for an adult and it actually goes past my knees so it's literally so soft as well I tried to show this in my vlog and it wasn't that easy can you see how soft it is the quality is so good love it so soft 
got kind of leaves on it but it's like a neutral color so it looks quite like sophisticated so i'm like sophisticated in my dressing gown rather than bright pink which was what my old one was what should i show you next i have something amazing coming soon to this video in a minute so next we have my foundation can you see it so I did talk about this in a vlog also. It's the True Match L'Oreal Foundation. Some people often say nice things on my videos like that my skin's glowing and stuff. Thank you, you're nice. But it's not. It's just this foundation is great. And it just has like a, a glowiness to it, I think. So I wear the 77W Golden Amber. Oh, there's something in my eye, what is it? I think the dressing gown just molted in my eye. Dressing gown, why are you doing this to me? I just said nice things about you. It's just a very nice foundation. It's just from Boots or Superdrug, so it's very cheap. It's about 10 pounds, maybe 12, and it lasts ages. I just put it on with my little blue, blue, <laughs> blue blender, beauty blender. If you look close, can you see? That you can actually see the product is glowing. So it's just a very glowy foundation and I'd highly recommend. I don't know much about makeup and so I don't really want to invest in really expensive makeup because, you know, it's fine for me. So if you're looking for like a less expensive makeup that makes you look like you're glowing, this is the one for you. But obviously like, you know, try out different colours because the colour I wear might not suit you. I still do have a little bit of tan from the summer. And I soon will probably need a lighter one because it is rather dark, but yes, so that's that. Two more things. I'm just going to show you these first. So the bit of food that I'm showing you this month is these. So these are the Protein Power Cookies by Woman's Zest. And they taste very nice. So with a lot of protein products, they don't taste nice. No matter what anyone says, they just don't. I don't eat that much protein products. I drink whey protein, and this is probably one of the only protein snacks that I'm liking at the moment. So, literally, I ordered like 20 of these because <laughs> um, they, they're just really, really nice. Obviously, they do taste a little bit proteiny. They don't taste fully like a cookie because then you wouldn't be getting a protein cookie. But they don't taste, they don't have a horrible aftertaste or anything like that. The texture is quite thick. Yeah, it's quite a thick texture, so it's quite hard to eat them fast. So I tend to eat one and then maybe later on in the day I'll eat the other or I'll just save the other one for another time because they come in packs of two. And they're only about two pounds, I think. And yeah, I just think they're really nice. I like the, the plain chocolate ones the most. They also have white chocolate, which I do quite like. Niall likes them more, so Niall always orders the white and I always order the plain. If you like white chocolate, obviously, I just like plain milk chocolate more, but the white chocolate ones taste really good if you're into white, white chocolate, yeah. So yeah, that's them. And the last thing I'm gonna show you is probably the best thing of the month. And uh, you will have seen these on my Instagram and my YouTube and <laughs> these, these are incredible. So I have been looking, as I spoke in my last favourites video about NMDs, these are Adidas NMDs. For anyone asking, that's the model I basically only wear in trainers because um, they're so comfortable, they're not really hot. I hate hot trainers. These are very airy, but they're soft, they're quite flat, so they're good for weightlifting, um, but they're also quite good for running. Uh, I'd say they're because they're, they're quite padded, they have like the boost bit in the sole. God, I sound like I work for Adidas. I don't work for Adidas, I just love their trainers. <laughs> um, and then, they released these pink trainers a very long time ago, and they sold out probably within about a minute. And it was a very sad time because every time they restocked, I missed it. You know that how that always happens. I just I'm not very good at online shopping and being one of those on the ball people that it just gets. You know, if you're waiting for tickets or something, I cannot handle it. The stress is real. So 
then I saw on Hannah Oberg, I don't know if that's how you say her name, um, but she was, she bought these like recently and I was like, what? They're back. I got these from Zalando and for some reason, because they're exclusive I think, Zalando, they don't sell these on Adidas or I don't think anywhere else at the moment as far as I know this colour. So they're very exclusive. So they are slightly more expensive than normal NMDs. I think I bought them for 120, 130 pounds, I think. But I, I was like, I don't, I don't even care. It's an investment I'm willing to make and my NMDs tend to last me a very long time. I bought my first pair of NMDs like over a year ago and they're still in great condition. They still, I still wear them most days. I obviously if you get like white NMDs they last a bit less time because they get dirty really easily. So I, with these, which is also another thing I'm, I was going to say I love, dirt doesn't show up that easily on them and so you know, they, they obviously dirt will show up a little bit. I think I've got a little bit of dirt on the toe. Does anyone else get that when they wear trainers? Just the toe. But yeah, they don't show dirt that easily, which is great. So I don't worry too much. Whenever I put on my white NMDs, I'd be like looking at my weather app, thinking like, what's the weather going to be like later though when I get out of the gym? And so, you know, it was a bit stressful. And I don't really enjoy wearing them anymore because even when I'm in the gym and I kneel over or something and I put my toe on the floor, it's dirty. But with these, they don't do that, so it's great, great, great things. And also, Zalando has other exclusive colours, which I really want, like baby blue! But I think the baby blue ones actually are in other stores now, so they're not as exclusive. But as far as I know, these are only on Zalando at the moment. So I'll try and link them below, because they are incredible. And I would say, with NMDs, I always go up a size, because they are quite tight and they don't have a lot of room like some trainers. I'm ideally a 5.5, but in NMDs I'm a 6. Yeah. So that's what I'd say with them. They are slightly undersized. <laughs> so, that is all of my favourites this month. And I've been talking for 25 minutes. What a surprise. Why can't I be one of those short video people? that just films within like 10 minutes. I just talk and talk. But anyway, I'm gonna wrap this video up so that it's not any longer than it already is. I hope you enjoyed these this vid these videos. <laughs> hope you enjoyed this video. I hope there was something there you liked. Obviously my, well actually, my favorite is the NMDs because I've been looking for them for like a year. But then the dressing gown has a special place in my heart because me and him, him? Would I say it's a him? Me and him spend every morning together and most evenings together. I think he might be a her actually because he's from the women's section. But yeah. Anyway, thank you so much if you watched this video. If you have any questions about anything, don't forget to leave them below and I will reply to you. And yes, hopefully I'll be able to link everything. I should be able to because everything is quite new except the pre mark stuff may be a little bit harder, so I would go in store for pre mark stuff so you can get exactly what you want. But anyway, thank you so much for watching. I will hopefully see you in my next video. Love you guys.